Now, an Aberdeenshire woman who, despite suffering a stroke, is now training to represent Scotland at one of the world's largest events in carriage driving. After a car accident nine years ago, Jane McGarvey from Inch was told she'd never regain feeling in one half of her body. Now she's in the running to join Team GB at the World Para Carriage Driving Championships. Kirsten Tate has more. You're getting to go out with that horse's head and looking between the ears. It's just lovely. After her stroke, Jane knew that getting back in the saddle would be difficult. But a sport steeped in tradition and history soon gave Jane back her freedom. I can't feel my left side and, and things are very difficult and holding things. If I stop looking at it for any great length of time, things just fall out of my hand. I don't really know where my left side is. It really helped a lot with um, confidence and just meeting and greeting and getting out there and, and just feeling that you could. She started as a beginner, looking for comfort and support. But fast forward a few competitions, she's now been chosen to train for a place with Team GB in the sport's biggest para event. I thought, right, 2019, let's go. And um, we managed to go down again with Jack to the national championships um, at Hartbury. And it was just fantastic to have your own horse. You know, you're amongst places where like the, the greats have been, if that makes sense, in my head. And then after that, we thought, well, Paras is maybe the next step to try and get towards, perhaps. Over here. The Geary RDA Carriage Driving Group has been run by Ruth since the late 80s. It's so important. It means so much to so many people. The carriages can take a wheelchair and we can go along the riverside and round the tracks and see the wildlife as well. <laughs> Nine years ago, Jane was told she'd never regain feeling in one side of her body. Now she could become one of a handful of Scots to ever represent Team GB in the World Para Courage Driving Championships. I never, I never thought it would potentially go this far. Um, we just, you just don't know what's in front of you, so you just think, well, um, just progress as much as you can. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Kirsten Tate, STV News. What a lovely story. Well, now it's time for all the sport with Chris, who's out of the studio tonight at Dens Park.